Your query section because uh, there are plethora of funds available in the market to invest your hard-earned money in. But how do you assess which is the right fund for your portfolio? What are the criteria that one should be looking at uh, to help you navigate through all of this? Today I have with me Anand Tanda, founder of Invest Arch for Kal. Uh, Anand, good evening and welcome to the show. But uh, for our viewers also, just in case you are watching the show live and you want to send across your questions, you can do that on our WhatsApp number, which is eight six five seven nine seven four five seven one, and our email ID is uh, the money show at etnow dot tv. Anand, let's take uh, first question, which is from Raj Kumar, and uh, he's doing uh, SIP in a couple of funds, uh, HDFC Midcap, uh, Quant. He's not given the scheme's name. Mahindra Manulife also he's not given the scheme's name. Nippon Small Cap, and uh, Quant Large Cap and Mid Cap. Uh, Parag Parik Flexi Cap, Nippon Multi Cap. The goal is to invest for 12 years for his retirement. He's 45 right now. He wants to know if he's on the right path or not. Uh, uh, okay, so he's got Mahindra Manulife. Uh, okay, Mahindra Manulife and HDFC Mid Cap. He's got uh, Nippon Small Cap, Quant Large and Mid Cap, Parag Parik Flexi Cap, and Nippon Multi Cap also. Uh, so. Clearly, the question uh, is how much corpus he actually needs in 12 years. I don't have those details on me, and I don't have him on the phone line. Also, Anand, how can you help him? Hi. Firstly, thank you so much for having me on the show. So, presently, uh, the investor is doing 35,000 rupees SIP uh, with a 12 years mindset. We can expect 12% uh, CAGR, which are which is kind of uh, uh, comfortable looking at present market situation, looking at the economy growth and the inflation rate of India. I think uh, investor will be able to reach to a goal of 1.1 crores for retirement. Presently, if we look at his uh, investment uh, SIP corpus, he is investing in literally all the caps. He has uh, small cap in uh, in his portfolio. He has multi caps, and he he even has mid cap as well. So he has uh, invested in uh, all the caps. He just need to ensure few things. Firstly. Uh, he should always have some allocation in gold and debt. I hope he is taking care uh, care of uh, that allocation. Secondly, if he is increasing his SIPs, probably he can increase it towards the multi-cap category as a whole because looking at present market valuation and uh, present market structure, I feel multi-cap and uh, large-cap category might outperform for uh, coming few quarters, coming few years. So that can be his strategy. But from 12 years perspective, obviously mid-cap and small-cap still make sense if we are doing SIPs in those. Here is because we're talking about a goal-like retirement, Anand. Very important for one to understand uh, 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 the importance of lining up uh, a corpus, attaching an amount to your particular goal, which clearly Raj Kumar has missed. Although it's he missing. has the time frame right, uh, yeah, it's 12 years. Uh, uh, how can he uh, arrive to that particular corpus or that amount? How can you help him understand the calculation over here? See, calculation is very simple. Right now, on social media and on uh, apps and on uh, Google, we have retirement calculators which calculate your retirement corpus based on your present expenditure. You first need to figure out what expenditure you are doing today. Increase that expenditure by the rate of inflation. Probably you can take 7% as a decent rate of inflation. Then you will get a number which will help you uh, decide your retirement corpus. Do By the way, we even have a FIRE principle. Uh, we just need to find out the expenditure which you will be doing probably uh, 12 years down the line. Multiply it by 25 or multiply it by 50 depending upon the amount of uh, independence you want to achieve. And then you can uh, get to the retirement corpus. I'll just discuss about fat FIRE. If you multiply your monthly expenditure by 12, that will give you annual expenditure. If you multiply that by 50, you are sorted for retirement corpus. So that can be a rough calculation, which is a fire principle for financial independence retire early, which you can use. Uh, Anand, I know we had to take more queries, but then uh, uh, your answers are always so uh, uh, detailed and uh, uh, so well in your explanation that my time is right now up for this particular question and answer session that we've taken live today. Thank you so much for being on the show and helping our viewers with their portfolio queries. And for all our viewers, I'm going to once again uh, leave you with our uh, WhatsApp number and email ID just in case you want to uh, you want any help from us as far as your financial portfolio is concerned. Uh, do send across your questions on our WhatsApp number and email ID. Thank Thank you so much for watching. Goodbye.